leave black men alone. Now, ultimately, that's going to be up to you. But you need to put your thinking cap on and look at what's going on around you. It's a hot mess out here in these streets. But the common denominator of all the fights between the mammies and the divesters and the fence sitters and the, all, all that shit, at the bottom of that nasty ass pot, you're going to find a black man. It's only because of black men that we don't get along. If there was no such thing as black men, we probably get along. <laughs> okay. But I have a f- That is truth right there in my opinion. Because so many times these people will basically revolve their damn lives around a damn man. And because they are so revolved around men, they have such issues, it seems like, with anything that they feel is affecting black men or anyone talking against them. They want to get favor from, you know, basically black men, so they try to put other women under the bus. Everything is around a man at the end of the day with these individuals. And I don't mean this just on, like, YouTube or anything. In real life, you see mammies, fence-sitters, you know, people who are divested. When they interact with each other, there's a black man around. They cut each other so hard and they slice each other up over that black man. It's like... A black man is like gold to them, in my opinion. It's really bad, like, to get so shysty over a man, you know? It's not just black women and black men. I'm just talking about black men and black women. It's also white women will do this as well for white men, you know? It's often that women just get so cutthroat, in my opinion, when it comes to um, men, in my opinion. So I wouldn't say this is particularly just black women issue. It's a woman issue at the end of the day, in my opinion. But yeah, this is, speaks to something that is just really problematic with women, in my opinion. So yeah, I just like this piece of uh, Divested Zealots video. Thanks for watching, everyone. Like and subscribe, comment down below. I gotta go. Bye.